Wait, are you that kid? Okay, so give us a little bit of an intro for your characters. So I play Melissa Bowen, uh, Tandy's mom, AKA Dagger, and you are? I am Miles Mustin, and I play Otis Johnson, Cloak. I am Tyrone's father. I'm an example of everything you should not do as a mother, and you are? Well, I try to be the right example for my son <laughs> as much as I can, but uh, maybe, maybe, maybe smothering him a little. He may feel that too much love sometimes, but uh, I'm just trying to make sure he's on a straight and narrow and doing the right things. And my daughter may feel not enough love sometimes, <laughs> sadly. Yeah, it's a lot darker than I expected it to be. Yeah. Um, so, did you guys know about your characters before you went into this? Um, you mean from the comics? Yeah. Oh, no, uh, no, not at all, actually. And, and, and between the time of actually getting to know, I'm playing the character and shooting was like two days, you know, yes, a, a, day, yes. a day and a half before I had to jump on the plane. So, no, um, and, and even after, there's not a whole lot about Tyrone's dad out there. So. Well, somebody was mentioning that today, that um, it is rare that we have Marvel parents. And so, kind of feel special about that. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And so, what is it about the show that you think is going to hook viewers? I, I think, first of all, Olivia and Aubrey are two tremendous talents. They're they, ringers. They, they, yes. are, they are amazing uh, actors um, and just people in, in general. So, I think they're going to hook them in. I think we have, uh, I think there's something special that, that's here uh, because they, they're teenagers that are going through these life, you know, that, um, and we're telling the story in a real way, you know, uh, uh, with addictions and, you know, and these type of things. But they, on top of all the, the things that teens go through, they also are, they have to, they have superpowers, <laughs> you know? Um, so I, I think just that we're telling the story, the way we're telling the story in such a gritty way, such a real way, um, honest, uh, I hope that that's going to hook people in. And I'd also like to hear your thoughts on superhero love stories. Well, I think that we have a very special superhero love story. Um, Aubrey and, and uh, Olivia are so talented, and they have a, 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 a special bond between them um, that's palpable, and that, because we have not been able to see the episodes yet, but that I hear is 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 there all over the place on the screen so that is is we're we're definitely um completely on our way to like a wonderful superhero love story uh however just like all great and tragic love stories their worlds are so very different they ha how they operate with their powers together is going to prove um to be incredibly interesting difficult and complex and uh and then they both um, are still dealing with so many issues from the past and issues of dealing with their family, mm -hmm. you know, with their parents. Uh, so there's, there's a tremendous amount going on.